Hi, Shauna with Valkyrie Consulting. I am walking you through the back end of a WordPress site that we recently developed for CarlyWalker.com. If you want to see the front end of the site, just check out our YouTube channel under Portfolio, and you can uh, check that out and actually see the site in action as well. But this is going to be the back end of one of the WordPress builds that we do, and we are shooting different WordPress build tutorials so that you can learn how to better use WordPress or you can talk to us and ask us questions as the experts. So, what you're looking at right now is actually the dashboard for her site. You can customize the dashboard however you want. What I did for this particular client was go in and customize her dashboard so she can see her site stats directly after her launch, um, advanced ads, which we'll get into as far as monetization goes, do a quick draft if she's got something on her mind uh, so that she can save it to publish later. And then anything relevant to WordPress news updates, things of that nature. Uh, we try to block as many things as we can that are spam filters or malicious login attempts for every single one of our clients so that they know their WordPress site is safe and secure and not going to get hacked. So that's one of the reasons that you want to hire an expert to do this. We also install uh, some different plugins that assist with SEO, both on page and off page, and give you guys tutorials on how to use that as well. So just kind of giving you a quick overview of what we do on the dashboard. Uh, we also have activity on here. And then for this particular client, because she is going to offer sober coaching and recovery coaching starting in 2016, We've gone ahead and set her up for success by providing her with a paid memberships plugin to where people can purchase memberships and pay for her online coaching services and video coaching services or even one-on-one -on -one sessions uh, for her and actually have exclusive access to content on the site that's not available to just everybody. So walking through a little bit about uh, her WordPress site a little more in depth, one of the things that we like to use here at Valkyrie Consulting is a program called Jetpack. And what Jetpack does uh, is actually allow the user to auto-publish blog posts on social media. So that's just another way that we tie in the social media back to your website so that you're not having to kill yourself in, you know, posting and, and reiterating over and over the same thing. Now there's some other strategies we use as well that's more appropriate for a social media marketing video, but this is just specifically for WordPress. So with WordPress, uh, in order for her to do this, what she's got to do is go into the publicize feature. And in the publicize feature, which is actually under settings uh, on her WordPress site over here, and I'm going to wait for this to load. So what you have here is enhanced distribution. Um, enhanced distribution automatically takes it and shares it with third-party services, uh, search engines, uh, does all of the you know SEO optimization for you, which is really, really cool. So we activate as many things as we possibly can in Jetpack for clients because there's just so much that uh, they can do. So what Carly still has to do on her end is actually go into publicize and hit the configure button and then what she's going to do is log into each one of these social media accounts that she wants to sync each one of her blog posts up with so all you have to do with this is it's very simple you just simply hit the connect button which is right here and it'll bring up a sub menu and it's just running a little bit slow right now so bear with me um, it'll bring up a sub menu that'll ask you what service you want to connect it to. Do you want to connect it to a page? Do you want to connect it to a profile? Yada, yada, yada. So I can do it to any of the pages I manage or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> and she can change it, you know, however she wants, which is very cool. And then you have sharing buttons that will be at the bottom of each page as well with Jetpack. So again, Jetpack is a fantastic, fantastic resource. Um, I highly recommend it for everybody who's using WordPress because it just does so much of it for you um, and, and allows you to, you know, install things like VaultPress, which does backups and security scans. Um, and it just makes your life so much easier because it gives you just kind of an all-in-one dashboard, which is one of the reasons that we use it ourselves and we also use it for most of our clients. Uh, this right here, Akismet is 
a spam filtration tool. Uh, a lot of times, once you've released a new site and once it starts moving out there into the Google space, what you're going to find is a lot of people uh, leaving spammy comments on your site. So what you do is you just simply go into Akismet. Um, you get your API key by registering uh, with WordPress.com. And there's there's a difference, guys, between WordPress.org and WordPress.com. Again, one of the reasons you want to hire an expert because we know this stuff. But you simply just plug in the API key and it will actually filter out your spam con contents for you so that you're not having to kill yourself on that. Um, post page is relatively self-explanatory. This is where you're going to put your blog post. And again, guys, a blog post does not always have to be written content. It can be a video, a lot like this one, which is actually going to go on the Valkyrie site as kind of a tutorial video. It can be infographics. It can be just about anything you want. So you have all of these things on here on the back end that are going to be, you know, posts, um, that she's done categories. The idea with categories, and this is actually going to be in a Udemy course that we're offering uh, starting in January, where categories are kind of the parent and then the tags are the children. So categories, you want to keep those pretty tight, uh, you know, no more than five to ten. And then tags, you can have as many as you want. So, you know, then you have a media library. That's where you're going to upload videos or uh, pictures or anything of that nature uh, that you know want you want to put on your site or on your blog uh, just you know different photos that you can access whenever you need to insert those into a post pages pages are static content which means that you actually have to go in and change them whereas blogs will dynamically update they publish on and update your website as soon as you hit the publish button a page is a little bit different so we have some different pages in here for Carly, um, her basic pages, and then some programming on the back end to where we want blog pages to look a little bit different than the home page. So we've changed that up a little bit. So that's a little programming on, on our end. Um, and then, of course, you know, we've done program pages for a glossary in addition to um, working with MailChimp. Uh, that's the CRM that we help this client select and, you know, kind of guided her towards because we think that that's going to be the, the best solution for her right now. Now, it's not an applicable or appropriate solution for every business, but it is for this one. Um, Ninja Forms was another thing that we utilized when we were building this site. Uh, it's a fantastic uh, form processing tool that allows her to collect user information that's in over and above in addition to MailChimp. But what's cool about it is you can plug in Ninja Forms or even Contact Form 7 to her MailChimp. So you're, you're still getting all of those leads and all of that business into the same CRM. So that's one of the things that, you know, we're kind of thinking of for you as we're building the site and saying, okay, how can you utilize this later so you're not losing leads or lead capture? And, and the same is true of Sumo Me, which I'll walk you through in this video as well. Um, comments, this is where you're actually going to go when people begin commenting on your blogs to where you can moderate it. You know, if you've got things that are not appropriate or that detract from your message, you can delete those as opposed to responding to them. You can reply to comments direct on this section. And I know what I do for our blogs on Valkyrie when I'm using this is I'll just go in and look at all the comments for each blog or, you know, you can even block authors. If you've got an author who might be a little bit abusive or you know, is not leaving appropriate stuff on your site or is being spammy, you can actually block all posts by author. So there's a lot of functionality here, which is one of the reasons that we use WordPress. Now, one of the things that we suggested for this client was actually an FAQ page. And, and this is almost relevant to just about any business out there because most of you are going to find that you're asked a lot of the same questions. I know I, as a business owner, am asked a heck of a lot of the same questions. Um, on a regular basis, so that's one of the reasons that in our own redesign, we're, we're going to have a FAQ section. But what we've done here is given her a plug-in with FAQs to where she can add categories, uh, settings, questions as, as needed. So, you know, whenever she's got somebody who's posting, say, a comment to one of her FAQ 
uh, questions or posting an answer or even suggesting their own FAQ, she can go in and add it on her own without having to pay us extra to do that. So that, that's another really cool thing that we added to this particular client site. And again, this is programming stuff on the back end, but you know, this is, this is what we do. Um, you have, we have a feedback section on here and what this feedback section does, and it's not uh, up and running yet, but we like to think forward with our company beyond the first iteration of a website. So when we're doing these things, when we're doing like feedback testimonials for a brand new site for, you know, some, a business that's just launching, cause we do love our startups. Um, we want to make sure that we've set you up for success so that your customer feedback, your testimonials are there, they're programmed in, they know exactly where to go in your pages. So all you really have to do is copy and paste that information in there. So that's something else that's kind of cool. Um, projects that she's doing, any type of uh, workshop that she wants to offer, seminar, anything like that, she can showcase that. We've already got the programming done on the back end for her to utilize that. Slides, this is what you see on her home page where we have different uh, slides and slider bars. She can go in there and update those whenever her little heart desires. So she can simply click on the slides button and she can go in and edit exactly what is on that slide um, as far as what image is on there and, and where it links to. So that, that's something else that we have done. Uh, testimonials, again, this is something that is a work in progress and is more appropriate for the second iteration of her site, but we like to set her up for success with that also, so we made sure that that's already programmed in there, and when she starts adding these, guess what, they're already, there's already a section in there programmed off on her homepage to where they'll go, and it'll look nice, and she doesn't have to worry about it, she doesn't have to sweat it. Um, forms, this is what I was speaking about a moment ago uh, when I was talking to you about Ninja Forms. Really, really fantastic. So, you know, all you've got with WordPress, and, and one of the reasons I love it is because when you want to install a form, all you got to do is pre-build the form and what you want to know about a client or potential client, uh, whatever kind of questionnaire you feel is appropriate, either for a static page or a blog page or what have you. And you can go in there and just simply copy paste the short code and put it into a page or into a blog post or, or wherever you feel is appropriate on your site. So we like that a lot and we are, we're actually able to uh, plug that into MailChimp, which is great. So that if you have somebody submitting a form for something, you still got them in your email database and you don't have to have somebody go in and dig through and data mine all of that information, you, you can just, auto, it's automatically done for you. So we like to automate as much of our business owners' uh, websites as we can so that they're not having to stress out or an assistant's not having to stress out. And it doesn't take away from the day-to-day -day activities of your business. Your website, your blog should be a supplement to your business. It should be something that complements it, not something that stresses you out and takes you away from it. That's one of the reasons we as a consulting firm come in and we say, okay, how can we automate this and how can we make your life work smarter, not harder? So that's, that's one of the things that we look for uh, when we do a site build. Now, advanced ads. Our call to action at Valkyrie Consulting is all about monetizing your marketing and monetizing your website and knowing how to do that. This is one of the plugins that we utilize to help our clients do just that. Now, what I have Carly doing right now as part of my consulting services is going through and actually signing up for 15 to 20 different sites that are appropriate and complementary to what she wants to do. And once she is approved for those programs, what we're going to do is start injecting ads in specific places in her blog post based on what we know works. So what we can do with this is actually put in different ad codes and those ads will automatically rotate. So she's not having to constantly update ads. Now, for those of you that have worked with AdSense or some of the other things before that, that are taking your contextual based or, or utilizing behavioral uh, programming, those are so hit and miss these days. And it's so easy for you to get disapproved with AdSense if, if they have a whim to disapprove you. So, what I've done is compiled a very comprehensive resource for our clients to where, okay, I want you to go here, 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 and sign up for these things because I know that they work. And then I coach you around where to put them in your blog, how to blog around them, 
uh, you know, where, where they're supposed to go so that you can actually start making money. And when people say how much, it's, it's a thousand or more a month. It, it really depends on how much you post, the quality of your content. And, and I cannot stress quality of content enough. Uh, there's so much garbage out there. The only way that people are going to be able to filter through it is by actually looking at your content and saying, wow, this is freaking fantastic content. So I, I want to read more about this or I want to share this. So, you know, when you're looking at placing ads on sites, we vet our clients and we vet their content uh, pretty hef heavily because we don't, uh, how do I want to put this nicely? <laughs> I don't want to put our name on something that, that is garbage. So when we say Valkyrie, we are selective about who we work with and, and we do look at their quality of content before we start working with them because we know that those are going to make for the absolute best case studies for us to be able to showcase what we can do by having somebody who's creating really top-notch quality content. So this is just something that we're, we're utilizing and again it's still in uh, the building stages for Carly because she's still signing up for all of the things that I gave her to do as homework but again, I've already programmed this in here so that she's set up for absolute success. Um, webinar system. One of the things that Carly is offering on her site is online coaching and online videos and, you know, a, a bunch of different things for her clients. So as we're helping Carly compile this information and put it together, we've already got something in place for her to put webinars, live webinars, recorded webinars, whatever she wants to do, utilizing all kinds of cool systems that are both free and things that will monetize, like, you know, utilizing Google Hangouts, which then publishes direct to your YouTube channel. I mean, we really do try to think of everything that we can do when we're consulting with the client on how they're going to make money, both on the front end of their site, through the services they offer, the products that they're selling, but also on the back end as well. That's why Valkyrie Consulting is all about monetizing your marketing because it's just, it, it, it's, it just makes more sense. If you can make a thousand, two thousand, five thousand, ten thousand dollars on the back end of your site in addition to what you're making from your business while you're boosting your business, why would you not want to do that? You know, it allows you to take more vacations, buy that car, you know, fund your kids' college, whatever it is you want to do with those funds. It allows you the freedom to do that, and it also allows you the freedom to run your business. So that's one of the reasons we do that. Now, appearance, themes, and customization. There's a lot of resources out there that will talk to you about this with the free themes that uh, WordPress offers. And there are some really good free themes that you can get on WordPress.org. We don't use them. We either custom design the themes ourselves. I use uh, Themeler and Artistier to custom design uh, themes for our clients, or we know how to customize uh, different themes that are out there as well. So every theme and every customization tutorial is different. For this particular site, I use the Crescent theme, which you can find on Elegant Themes. Uh, really fantastic theme. Very easy to work with. So I enjoyed that. Plugins. Plugins are a lot of the things that we've added that I've kind of already gone through with you on the back end. When you have different plugins in here, you're going to have to update these pretty regularly, or you can hire us to do it for you where we go in and we actually look at these things on a regular basis and update them and see what's working, what's not working. If there's a better plugin out there, we're always on the lookout for those things so we can change it out pretty easily for you. Um, but this is just kind of an overview of all of the things that we've gone in and put in as plugins for Carly and also configured uh, for Carly. So that's that's something else to consider as well. Um, users, that's where you can add additional authors to your blog, and I'm going to get into that in a minute, um, as well as subscribers uh, and also different paid levels of membership. So there's some options there as well. Um, and then we have also done a couple other things in here where I've added a few importing tools that she can utilize later on, exporting tools, and also something called AdMiner. That's just another resource to monetize her blog, monetize her homepage, and monetize her site. Settings. Uh, this is where a few of the other plugins and widgets that we have put into her site have gone. Uh, one of the things that I've utilized here is Amazon Link Engine, and if you look at the front end side of Carly's build, where we put in the Amazon Bookstore, 
that's one of the ways that we generated that Amazon bookstore link uh, on that page so that she's getting credit for that and she's earning commissions off of the different books that she's recommending and what she thinks is appropriate uh, for her audience. So, you know, it, it's a way for her to communicate that, but it's also a way for her to earn commissions on whatever it is she inspires her audience to read. Um, PMP, PMP is Paid Memberships Pro. Because Carly is offering things like sober coaching, recovery coaching, and video coaching, uh, PMP is incredibly important. And this is where she can get a license for that should she decide to purchase it. The free version works appropriately for now. And then I also gave her another option. Um, in addition to Jetpack, which I went over with you, it does require a little bit more programming on the back end. I use it on uh, our Valkyrie site. It's an auto poster and it posts to so many different social media resources automatically. Now, with that in mind, it's still important to have a good social media software on the back end where you can go in and schedule posts. And that's something that our Get Social software does fantastically. Um, I can go in and schedule posts to repost every two days, five days, 10 days, 30 days, whatever, um, you know, for several months. And, and what I tend to do with my marketing campaigns is I'll do it for 90 days because you can't really tell if something is working or not working unless it's 90 days out. But there's a lot of homework that's done before we decide what we're going to post. Also, uh, Sumo Me. This is where we install the welcome mat and all of these other, you know, cool tutorials. And Sumo Me is a monster in and of itself as far as, you know, configuration and looking at analytics. And I'll go over that in a little bit, but this is just where it lives. And then info links, that's another way for her to monetize her, her site that I had her sign up for. And we've got a widget for that as well that we can uh, program and customize once she gets all uh, set up with that account. Um, guest post. I sincerely believe for many different bloggers, authors out there, having that community feeling is so important and having that traffic where somebody can come in and guest blog for you uh, and, and posting that out there is so crucial. So we have actually programmed in a guest blog tool for her that Instead of her having to go in and copy and paste everything, it will actually save to her drafts folder in her post section so she can review it, um, you know, simply add a featured image or, you know, change a featured image that somebody has, has set up. And then the sharing options, that's going to take you back into Jetpack as well. Um, WPI, this is a really cool plugin that I have fallen completely in love with. Um, what we've done with this is actually created the different buttons that we put on her website uh, for sober coaching, promoting her book, submitting guest blogs, and reading this. And again, using short codes to do that, both in the sidebar and in the static pages. So you can do different styles. You can do all kinds of different things in there. I mean, it would literally take hours for me to go through how to do this. And this is really just an overview, but it really does offer a lot of functionality. Now, I also mentioned that we, we do install things that will, will utilize SEO for you and help you with your SEO. One of the things that we really like for this is Yoast. Um, it helps you generate your titles and your meta tags, which are what you're going to submit to the search engine so they can start calling you and people can find you online. And then also your social settings and submitting your XML sitemaps. I mean, there's a lot to this. You've got to be registered with Google Analytics. You've got to be registered with Google Webmaster Tools, Bing Webmaster Tools. I mean, there, there's a really a lot to this back end stuff. It's not as simple as have a website and, oh, people are going to come to my website. There, there's a lot of work that has to be done on the back end. Yoast helps us do that for our clients. So that's one of the things that we utilize, but also so that our clients can go in and see for themselves exactly what we've done, how we've configured it, and the results that they get from it. Because I tell you what, the clients who use this, as opposed to the clients who don't get such better results, um, it, it is really amazing how the, the difference between the two. Um, we had one client that wasn't using it for a while. Now she's using it, and she went from zero comments on her blog post to over 2,000 comments every month uh, just by having us implement some SEO strategies and some help with that. So it makes a big difference. <clears throat> I mentioned MailChimp. A little while ago, um, MailChimp is great for those of you who do not have a large budget uh, for your CRM tool, which is your customer relationship management. 
I've gone in and she signed up for the account. I went in, I configured it, I connected it, I got her API keys, everything's plugged in. That's how I integrated it with Ninja Forms and Contact Form 7. So it really does make a big uh, difference there. And then we can put all the subscribers into different lists. We can put the subscribers in different places, wherever she wants them, so that it's easy for her to organize her business her newsletters and send out her promotions. So that's just another thing that we did. Uh, Facebook feed, this is how we build that widget to where you see on the right hand side of her page, her Facebook plugin to where you see her homepage, her, you know, like count, and then also a preview of everything that she's got on there. Um, this is where we put in her glossary plugin for her glossary page. And again, this is so easy for her to go in and update after the fact. Um, you know, so she doesn't have to rely on us for everything, which is fantastic. And, you know, we, we love helping our clients out and we love continuing to work with you as you grow. But if you want to add something on the fly and you don't want to have to wait for us to do it, boom, you can do that, you know, right here. So, you know, she can go in and add a glossary item simply by clicking this button and boom, you know, it's done. And she can save it as a draft so she can see what it looks like so that she has any problems or questions with that, she can come back to us with that and we can help her, you know, walk her through that. Instagram feed, same thing. We put in a plug in here. Um, we went in, did a little programming on the back end as we always have to do to get her, you know, access token and user IDs so that we can display her Instagram feed on her page. But that's another great way to connect with your audience on social. And then the Amazon link as well, where we have the, you know, setup options for all of the different things that she can put from Amazon.com on her site that she recommends that, you know, have been inspiring to her different books or different things that she can read that are helpful to her. And then, of course, we went in and we got her public key and her private keys put in there so that she's set up for success as she does more promotions with that. Memberships, this is where we have her membership uh, plug-in ready to go. Uh, essentially, she can take payment direct on her site. Uh, we've, we've had her set up with Stripe so that she can accept credit cards uh, for her coaching services, for consulting services, uh, webinars that she wants to offer, seminars, whatever. So again, we like to set you up for success whether you're doing e-commerce or not. We can do all of that. We make sure that you know, you're completely set up and configured because it just makes sense. And then um, we also made sure that we have a database plugin so that she can back up her site and uh, not lose anything because we don't want that to happen. That can be extremely frustrating. Uh, last but not least, I'm going to just walk you through Sumo Me. Uh, maybe not. No. Okay. Sumo Me. Like I said, this is a monster in and of itself, um, but it is so, so vital. Um, we've gotten a side ID for her. What Sumo Me allows her to do is have things like a welcome mat, which is a pop-up to collect email subscriptions, and then also something on her sidebar that does the same thing, uh, in addition to a few other really cool items on her site uh, where she can go in and look at different heat maps to see what people are attracted to on her site and also review her Google Analytics that way as well. So that is just how we did it for Carly. If you have any questions about WordPress or how we worked on the site or anything else, uh, please check out the fully functional version of the site at carlywalker.com. Post all of your questions in the comment section below. Uh, we'll get back to you and we'll answer them. And then, of course, don't forget to subscribe uh, for a lot more information like this. And uh, stay tuned for the different Udemy courses that we're going to be offering in addition to a release I'm really excited about where we are going to teach you all of this step-by-step uh, -step for a very low monthly membership fee. Uh, where you get ongoing support and coaching uh, for a price that I don't think anybody's going to get their feelings hurt about. So, of course, thank you again for watching. We really appreciate your time, and uh, have a fantastic day.